and welcome to a very special holiday episode of the Greater Boston Galley Girls. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> <laughs> we're dorks. Okay, so we're going to start with our Christmas cocktail. Sounds fabulous. Yes, Indeed. we're going with a... What are uh, we making? Well, it's a peppermint holiday martini. I believe um, you called it a merry martini. Is I did. Correct? I keep changing my mind about yeah. it. You know, there's so many words we can play with. We make so, up a lot of things on this show. Yes, we do. Yeah. So this should be fun. It involves clear liquids, which I prefer. <laughs> We're going for three parts um, vodka, which will be three quarters of a cup. Cup, club, whatever you want. <laughs> We were talking about claws earlier, so it's all good. And you may have noticed that our fourth Gala girl, Jen, is not oh, here right. tonight. Yes. Um, but as we've mentioned before, she owns a boutique here in town, Marabou, that supplies all of our bling. And Which is why I'm blingless, out of solidarity. <laughs> it's so sad. It's very sad. Um, and this, obviously, in retail, is her busiest time of year. So we're going to mix up a little batch of these, and then I'm actually going to zip one down to her later on. Yes. Perfect. Which always is good when you go to ring up your jewelry and have someone with little pieces of candy cane and booze breath coming at you to say thanks awesome. for your purchase. Anyway, tis the season to be tipsy. <laughs> um, so we're going to now put in a quarter of a cup of peppermint schnapp. Schnapps. Which I haven't drank since college, <laughs> freshman year Nor in the dorm. However, I. when I went to the store to get it, I went to Blanchard's Liquors in Brockton, City of Champions, and come to find out they have their own label. Who oh, knew? Oh. All right. I've stayed away from the entire Schnapps family since college. Peach Schnapps. Yeah. Schnapps. Uh, I'm not a huge Schnapps girl. For me. But too. shall we? Shall we prep these while we're talking? Yes. yes, we shall. So one of the lovely bits about this is the candy cane bits to make your cocktail a little more festive. We're we're going to do a nice little rim of peppermint candy. We took some some peppermints and crushed them up nice and small. Which is really good if you've been, you know, if the holidays are getting to you. Um, it's nice mm. to let out a little um, aggression sure. um, with a mallet and a, well, hello, um, a mallet and um, a plastic bag full of starlight mints. But look and, how cute and, this looks. Right, so you just rim them with a little bit of water, paper, wet paper towel, and then Alex presses them into the crushed mints and off you go. But if I'm not invited to your party, you can do it on your own. But if you haven't invited me, well, it's going to be lame. Party. And this is a cocktail served chilled, and you're going to have lovely breath, not to worry. <laughs> um, it's like an Altoid. Exactly. And if you want to throw a candy cane in it as a garnish, go for it. Um, this looks so cute and so festive. It is cute. And again, it's clear liquor, so it's just even more delightful. Here we are, ladies. Um, Excellent. I'm going to just go right out with a uh, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Cheers. Cheers. And cheers. 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 Okay. Delightfully yeah. refreshing. Mm. Oh my god, it is like an Altoid. It is. <laughs> it really is. It's a liquid Altoid. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm. You'd be the favorite party guest. <laughs> <laughs> Um, well, thank you, Jocelyn. I think that this should just set the mood off right and especially set off the party preparation perfectly. Absolutely. A lot of alliteration there. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Impressive. With vodka, no less. 